Hey, Walnut Creek Church, Pastor Kurt here, and I am so glad to be speaking to you this afternoon. I wanted to talk with you just for a moment about the COVID-19 update. Um, here in Texas, we are kind of in a second spike. Over the last three days, we've had over 15,000 confirmed cases, many of them in, in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, so much so that the Dallas County and Tarrant County have uh, taken a step backwards in some of the things they're doing as far as gatherings. It hasn't directly affected us from the, the county officials, but we wanna be very precautious and, and uh, take precautions to make sure that we keep you healthy and we are very concerned about your safety. And so one of, a couple of things that I, I wanted to let you know is uh, within the next week or two, we're going to be starting instituting thermal scans uh, when you come to church. There'll be someone at each door just to take your temperature and to make sure you have no temperature. Um, it's the, the forehead scan, so um, it's not, not real invasive. Uh, we're asking that if you feel bad or you're sick or you have a temperature, please stay home. If you come in and it registers over 98.6 on the scans, uh, then we will ask you to, to please go home and, and possibly, uh, you know, check and see if there's something going on with you. This is for your safety as well as ours. And uh, so we ask that you understand that. We're also going to be, in the next week or two, supplying face masks. And we ask that you would wear them while you're here at church as much as possible. It's not mandatory, um, but it's something that we're doing uh, for safety. Um, I visited with uh, obviously my doctor uh, this last week and my doctor stated that they conclusively know there are four things in the medical community that have kept them from spreading the disease. The four things that she told me that were uh, we needed to work on if we were going to have church was washing our hands regularly. We ask you to do that. We needed to maintain our social distancing of six feet. And we, I know that's hard, but we're gonna ask you to, to continue to help us with that. Um, the third thing was that we wipe down all the hard surfaces and sanitize them. We are working on doing that here at the church. And the fourth thing she said was helping slow or stop the spread of COVID was face masks. When you're in public, when you're in gatherings, to wear them and Tarrant County is, is requiring as well as Dallas County if you go out to businesses that you're wearing them and so we're asking that you wear them we're going to be supplying them if you have a medical condition and you can't we understand that we're not going to force you to do so it's not mandatory but we're going to ask you for concern of your health and the, the health of those around you that if at all possible you can wear those while you're here with us and I'm gonna be wearing mine. The doctors have said that, that if I get the COVID-19 because of my surgery and other health issues that I have right now, that I needed to wear a mask when I'm out in public. And so I'll be wearing mine if I'm not speaking when I come back to church. And so uh, just asking that you help us fight this. Uh, we, we have faith, we trust God, we believe he's gonna keep us, but we also wanna be uh, good stewards of the things around us, of our physical health and those are, around us and so we're going to take the precautions that are necessary uh, to help slow this down and we ask you we invite you to join with us and partner with us to help do that let me say that i really appreciate you gene and i love you and we appreciate the prayers and the support as i've been going through this and uh, um, i look forward to being back with you in service and seeing your beautiful faces we love you we appreciate you and i am praying for you god bless you